Hello everybody, got a video here on how to test these starters. This one's off of a mower and it's just your basic ground and your positive which would come from your solenoid. But we're going to test these, see if they're any good. And we got this style which is more like what you would see on your vehicle and you get your terminals here your positive would go here your key switch part would go here and when you turn your key it gauges that and makes your starter turn to start your engine but we'll test this one also but I would like to give a shout out to Super Clean. They're sponsoring a contest here for me. So whoever likes this video, put a hit the like button, comment down below, and subscribe to my channel, and that's all you gotta do to enter the contest. So, and when you do, you'll get a bottle of this which works really great as you can see I got a gallon of it and I got a couple other gallons that I ended up buying but you'll get the can of super clean like this and you'll get a bottle of this the gallon jugs you can get at other locations and they're about 10 bucks a gallon and it's well worth it so back to the starters here I'll try to get the camera positioned and to test these I got a jumper cables and they're hooked up to a 12 volt car battery so we'll go ahead and start with this one. I always hook the positive up first. That way on these here you don't end up melting the nuts or the threads messing them up. Just hook it on there and make sure you don't get it grounded to the metal of the starter. You just want it on the terminal part. And take and just touch anywhere on the metal here and that one's good so we'll set it back a lot of times if you don't have these set and upright the gear won't come back down which these springs need to be a little stronger on these ones. I need to replace that part. So make sure you put the positive on the terminal there. And just... And that one's good. positive on the terminal this one sounds a little rough when it's going there which it would probably last a little while I wouldn't put it on a customer's mower I'd put it on something of mine that I'm using the head hair needs to be done the spring on it is pretty much gone so I don't know what happened to it this came off of another mower so it does work but it needs a head redone here and it's not the greatest so I wouldn't put that one on another one besides my own like I said I need to take some of this 
super clean here and clean up these starters here before I put them on the shelf. On this one, always check the gear inside there, make sure it's good and no teeth are broke on it. To do this one, I will hook the ground up first because it's a little harder to do here. And I'll open these up and touch these too. I don't know if you can hear that on camera, but it's turning pretty slow. So it's pretty much junk unless you rebuild them or something. So this one would be a junk one. The solenoid, you could reuse it. Another starter of the same kind. But other than that, this one's junk. And that's how you test them. Now I'll spray some of the super clean hair on one of these and let you guys see how good it works. Sometimes you gotta let it soak a little bit before you wipe it off. On that, the black part looks really clean, almost like a new starter. So don't forget to like my videos, comment, subscribe, and get entered to win this contest by Super Clean. Thank you, and have a great day. Bye.